I'm Sister Maria Elizabeth Barovia, and I was born in Mexico City, but raised in Southern California and San Antonio, Texas. And my family, um, dad, uh, practicing Catholic from Mexico City, uh, my mom, an agnostic, uh, Protestant, non-practicing, who became Catholic as a young adult and met my father in Mexico. Uh, Our Lady Guadalupe is totally responsible for them meeting each other. So that's a pretty awesome part of my story. My, my dad actually did a nine-year novena before he met my mom. I have three brothers, two sisters, all younger than I am. So I'm the, I'm the, um, the older sister. Uh, I really had to do a little bit of struggle there in my discernment. I really uh, felt marriage was a beautiful vocation. Um, I also felt more and more attracted to relationship with Christ, with Jesus, uh, as a teenager. I, I think I thought of it as a young person, but I thought of being a UN diplomat, of being a ballerina, of, I mean, you name it, you know, I thought of it. Um, but I think as a high schooler, coming to um, learn how to pray, learn more about my faith, become engaged, uh, become more involved in volunteering and serving, something in my heart was like drawn to possibility of marriage, of giving my life in love in that way and having many kids. Uh, but part of me was also drawn to that type of deep relationship with Christ that more and more I felt no earthly love could fill my heart in that same way. Um, and yet it was a two-year struggle in, in active discernment where I really had to ask the Lord, Lord, I could really see myself giving myself loving, uh, receiving love, giving love in married life. And that's beautiful and it's an awesome vocation. Um, and I love children, I have to say. Um, like John Paul II, I love little kids. But I felt Jesus saying, am I not enough for you? Am I not worthy of your love and giving yourself entirely for me? And the more I would spend time uh, with youth in church-related things or time with prayer, um, and not ecstasy, no, you know, just, just time reading the Bible and uh, learning more about the Lord and just quiet moments where I would just go in the chapel at school, for example, and uh, spend five minutes. And it wasn't deep prayer, but I would just go and say, I know that you're here and I know that I feel at home with you and I want to know you. I really want to know you. And that would be like the beginning of our, our relationship, my courtship with Jesus, as you will. My favorite thing about being a sister, uh, the awesome people the Lord has allowed me to be His presence for in the world. Um, and every kind of person, not just one group of people, but the Lord has really blessed me with rich apostolic experience in bringing the Word. And what I really love, uh, direct outreach to individuals, leading uh, retreats, especially on how to pray the Word of God, and bringing our Pauline additions to rural communities. I think that's all been part of my life.